What is up guys and welcome back to the Johnny Q channel. Thanks so much for watching. Today's video is a little bit different only because I'm showing you something new to the vlog, something new to the channel, potentially going to be filming moto vlogs. I don't know, but it's just right here. I don't know if you can see it, but boom, that's what it is. The Yamaha R3. We'll run it. Please don't run over it. Don't run it over. Thank you for not running it over. Well, before we get into it, let's get some epic B-roll of the nice looking Raven Black R3. on this thing boom so yeah this is my first sports bike uh, so far I've been riding for about a week and I love this thing this bike has so much kick in the lower rpms I shift gear super fast just because it revs so high and it just it gets you moving it, get, it gets you there quicker it's got so much of a kick that I, I love it for that reason and again for my size this is the perfect bike I might upgrade to an R6 or like a you know R1 down the road this year but for right now, kind of going to get used to, to the R3 feel. Another thing that I do like about this bike is, I mean, just the overall, like, switches are really, like, really solid. And, like, they're very, you know, you feel safe and you feel like you're not going to slip. And they're not made loosely. They're made for, you know, the driver in mind. They're very adequate everything about it the handling is great uh, it's a very easy bike to maneuver very nimble and I've, I feel like every video that I've seen out there about the R3 everyone's saying oh it's so nimble and so light it actually really is nimble and very light and that's why it's so easy to maneuver and that's essentially why I chose it again as a first sports bike to kind of get to get a feel for what that thing can do and let me tell you it's it may be small to some people but that thing rips on the road that thing goes so fast i love it <laughs> Woo! it just gets me jacked it gets me pumped like i said this is a little different than the usual johnny q videos because i'm just gonna go through and kind of do an overview kind of run through of the r3 what it has what it doesn't have and what i'm gonna be doing this summer so let's get into it Okay guys, like I said before, what we have here is a 2017 Yamaha R3 in Raven Black. So good, so, so good. Uh, I guess the first thing I wanna note is that I have the stock exhaust on there. And I know there's a bunch of different exhausts like Voodoo, Kaufman, um, Akkulpritch, or so I don't know how it's pronounced, but it's something like that. I'm not, I don't remember the name, it's slipping my mind. But, you know, most people hate, most people are saying that this exhaust really sounds like a sewing machine. I don't know. I kind of disagree. I kind of like the way it sounds and kind of the way it looks. In my opinion, I mean, it does sound pretty, pretty beefy. Like when you first turn it on, it sounds wimpy. Sure. But when you start revving and you start actually, you know, hitting it and ripping it, it does sound pretty good. So let me, let me give you a, a test. So, I mean, it sounds pretty stealthy in my opinion. It sounds like it's an electric bike mixed with a sports bike, to be honest. It's it's dying because it just ran it cold, but... See, if I were to rip it... I don't know, that to me sounds pretty... That sounds pretty aggressive, and I like that about this bike. And so for that... I have the stock exhaust. Uh, this here used to be the stock lights that came out. It just looked really bulky and not so good. So switched those out to the, the super simple kind of sleek looking lights. 
uh, for the turn signals. Uh, this version does have ABS. Let's go to the front panel here and it's actually quite, quite nice. Let's see here. You know, I got digital and analog dashboard, which is awesome. So uh, really, I do like that about this bike. Turn that off. Now, if I get on here, I will say, the one thing that does bother me about this specific bike are the mirrors on the side here. When I have my arms out, I can only see my elbows. And that's pretty much it. I have to kind of lean over to really see what's behind me or actually literally look behind me. So that's, you know, I might change those mirrors out to something else that's a little sleeker and kind of more functional because you got to look where you're going. This 2017 Raven Black Yamaha R3 and I was going with a bunch of other different bikes. Like I looked at different bikes like the CBR 500, R6, uh, and some other cruisers. But if you look for what I do, just ripping around town, potentially do some road trips, this thing would be able to handle it no matter what. The guy was creeping the whole time. Like I don't know if he was trying to steal my stuff over there, but like he was just creeping. <laughs> and I mean, the R6 for me, it just was too big. And I didn't want that much power. This is my first sports bike. And so I wanted something light, something I could control and maneuver and handle on the highway, as well as, you know, commuting around town. This is also the Fender Eliminator kit. It used to have this big arm that came out here with the license plate. So we took that off, replaced it with these little, little lights. It kind of just slims down the bike. Same with those lights on the front there. And it just gives it an overall, just slimmer, more Batman-like, you know, cooler feel to it and I like it I like it a lot you know I'm not sure if I'm gonna change the exhaust out because I like it so much but I don't know we'll see within time this summer maybe I will do like a, a different exhaust and go from there I might these are the the stock halogen lights I might switch those out to some really sick looking blue or white LEDs so yeah there you guys have it nothing to it it's really just an overall uh, review and kind of look at the Yamaha R3 in Raven Black. This summer I do plan on doing some moto vlog vlogs, meaning, you know, I put a GoPro on, get some audio going, I'm on the road and I talk about the bike, I talk about different things, where I'm going, what I'm doing, and just different stuff like that on the channel. I don't know if you remember last year, but last year I had a Yamaha 650 and it was a good cruiser, but I feel like this is more of my style, more of a kind of sleeker looking BA all black again all black all black it's just mm, it fits the bill and I love it if you guys want to see anything else about the Yamaha R3 please let me know down in the comments below I'll try my best to answer all the questions that you guys have I know as a newbie uh, with the R3 I had tons of questions and I was hoping that someone would be able to answer them uh, they didn't so I had to do a bunch more research so with that being said guys I will catch you next time on the John and Q channel peace all right, let's go rip this. Let's go rip it.